Hey guys, it's Eliana here. Happy Thursday and welcome back to my channel. I am super excited to announce the giveaway winner of the $25 Amazon gift card. I really was <laughs> kind of shocked by the turnout. Um, so thank you to all of you who commented below letting me know where you're currently living and where you're from. Make sure to stay to the end to find out if you are the winner. So today I'm gonna to be talking about confidence. And I know that this is a topic that most people and probably everyone at one point in their life has struggled with. So I wanna share with you how I was able to achieve my confidence that I have today and also share with you tips on how you can boost your confidence as well. So now let's get into the first tip. Okay, so first things first, it's okay to have flaws. Everyone has them and it's something that it's part of being a human being. So something that really helped me kind of change my perspective on my confidence is accepting my flaws. And the minute that I changed my perspective and realized that, hey, you know, I'm, it's okay to not be perfect, nor will you ever be perfect. It really lifted just like a burden off my shoulders, realizing that, hey, it's okay to have flaws and really embracing them. So it's okay to have flaws, but don't obsess over it to the point where it's gonna deter you from actually moving forward and doing the things that you wanna do and living the life the way you wanna live it. So ultimately recognize your flaws, don't obsess over them. All right, so now I wanna to touch on jealousy. I know jealousy is actually <laughs> something that a lot of women struggle with. It's important to realize jealousy is natural. It's a normal reaction. You're never gonna be able to stop yourself from comparing yourself to someone else. It's natural when you see something or you see someone or maybe you know, you know somebody that is in a certain point of their career or a certain point in their profession, whatever it is, you're always gonna naturally compare yourself. It's just part of being human. But what's important is to, again, change your perspective on that jealousy and use it as fuel. Don't get jealous and then get angry and have that kind of stop you and where you're sulking and where you're like, I can't believe I don't have that. Why does that other person have that? Why don't I? Turn that into a different perspective and use that jealousy again as motivation. You know, I get on Instagram and I think Instagram, for example, for a lot of people is a negative thing. You get on Instagram and you see all these pictures of, you know, vacations and people um, with all these luxurious items and maybe amazing bodies. And you see a, a one picture and you see their flawless face and it's like, whoa, you instantly compare yourself. and for a lot of people that can really bring them down and i always say i'm i'm the type of person i love getting on instagram i love seeing all those things out there because what i use it is for inspiration that inspires me to work harder every day it inspires me to be better to be a better person to push harder every single day so that i can one day say i'm gonna achieve those things so since you're probably still gonna get a little jealous Try to be grateful, guys. Practice <laughs> gratitude every single day. And I think it's something that even myself, sometimes I falter on that, you know, I wake up in the morning and something bad happens or something doesn't go the way that I wanted it to go. And it's so <laughs> easy to just forget about all the amazing things that you have in your life. And it's just so important to practice gratitude, guys. Be thankful for everything that you have, even if it's something small, you know, because you have to realize that even that really small thing, really small good thing that happened to you, for someone else, that might, might be the highlight of their year. All right, guys, I really needed a coffee break here, so bear with me. Ultimately, 
just make sure that you're focusing on your blessings and showing gratitude every single day. And that's really going to help minimize you comparing yourself to others and lower your jealousy and at the end of the day, boost your confidence. So now I want to talk about nurturing yourself. So what does nurturing mean? It means being able to do things that are going to actually help you grow, things that are going to make you happy, things that are going to make you feel loved, things that are going to make you feel fulfilled. So one of the things that you can actually work on is your overall health. So yes, that means going to the gym, that means getting your exercise, that means actually trying to eat healthy. And it's not really just having the mindset that, oh, okay, I wanna have this type of body shape or I wanna look a certain way. It's actually just eating healthier, exercising so that you feel better. All right, guys, so I've been stuck inside all day, so I'm gonna take this outside. I'll see you soon. So we're here outside now and one of the things that I actually wanted to touch on is okay so what can I do something simple every day that is actually going to increase your confidence. So one of the things that helped me is that um, when I was really struggling with my self esteem and my confidence I actually wrote down a list of things that I liked about myself. So make the list and then I'm telling you every single day you're, it's going to get easier. You're going to come up with more things that you like about yourself that make you feel good about yourself. And I'm telling you it takes practice but eventually you're going to get to the point where that list is super easy to make. And when you actually look down at the list you're going to realize, okay, why was I tripping about my confidence and why was I feeling so low? And I'm telling you that little trick that you can use every single day is going to help you out. So before I forget, I do want to announce the giveaway winner of the Amazon gift card. And the winner of my giveaway is Steve Angel. So congrats to you and thank you so much for commenting on my video. Honestly guys, every like and comment does truly mean a lot and I'm so excited about all the support I've been getting just starting out. So if you do like my videos, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more, I do post videos every Monday and Thursday. So please make sure to stay tuned. Bye guys.